Hi there. Okay, so we're going to have a look at how to split out um, a model in Lightwave into separate layers via surfaces. Um, pretty simple. So I've got this uh, model up and running, and if we look in the surface editor here, you can see we've got surfaces of different colours. Now the point of what we're showing you here today is you're going to be using uh, a 3D Studio Max Lightwave importer, and it doesn't, it can't see. Um, surfaces when it brings the model in, so it'll just bring the whole model in as a polygon model, which is good because it won't flip out the polygons and everything. Um, <coughs> but the only downside of that is then I'd have to go and select all the polygons again to make the same surface attributes, which you know you've obviously spent some time on. So let's sort of make a, a work around to get this to work. Um, so let's um, let's just go in, zoom him up, and zoom in a little bit. Okay, so this is this uh, lander tin can model thing, and right, what I want to do is select by surface. So, if you open the poly stats um, window, which we've got open here, which is shortcut keys are W key, lowercase W key, um, and you've got polygons selected down the bottom here. When you go to surfaces here, you can click on that, and a drop down comes out, and it will show you all the surfaces you have and how many polygons each surface has. So let's try black stuff, so we'll say black stuff is selectable so we can see it's selected here. Hit the plus key that'll go and select those polygons. So all I'm going to do now is press X to cut okay, I'm going to go to layer 2 and hit V to paste and then when I'm on layer 2 I'm just going to call it black stuff. Okay. I'm going to hop back over to layer 1 again Alright, and under surface attributes, I'm going to go and select default, which is the next one down. I'm just going to go through it in a list. That's going to be the easiest way of doing it. So default, plus key, which is just those, X to cut, V to paste, go to that layer, which is here, double click it, and just call it default. Okay, back to one and go down to the next one then, so uh, surfaces glass plus key ok X to cut them new layer V to paste double click glass ok right, so if we go through the whole model doing that we're going to end up with lots and lots of layers ok, so that's great what we then want to do is save it out. How how many times there are layers, that's how many times you need to save it out. And when you save it out, call it whatever it's called. So I'm going to go and save this out, for instance, because that's um, black stuff is this. Okay. So I'm going to save this out as black stuff. So I'm going to call this file save as. Let's open this up. Okay. And we'll call this um, Mars and Solo, and we'll call this black stuff. Okay, and go with that. I'll also call this base file save object as base. Okay, so that's got all the files. Uh, we'll call it master. We'll call it master split. Okay, right, so what we've got currently is master split open, so I want to go and close that. Um, actually, you know what? We'll just we'll do the second one. We'll do the let's do the glass one. Actually, we'll do the glass one. So let's go and select layer this layer. Hit delete. Uh, that layer, delete. Default layer, delete. Glass layer. Uh, we'll go and copy it. C for copy. V for paste. Okay. That layer, delete. Okay. So all we've got in here <coughs> is glass. So we're going to call it glass. Now, while we're in polystats, we can do some um, things we can look at it. I just want to check a few things before you go and send it out. Make sure that when uh, Studio Max gets it, it can actually open it and doesn't have a problem. So, back in your st polystats thing, you need to make sure that you have, you don't have, sorry, listed any one vertex polygons or any two vertex polygons. Uh, because that's a that's an illegal polygon type in other applications. In in Lightwave you can have them. In other applications you cannot have one point polys and two point polys. If you do, 
in your model, delete them so they're not there, or go and fix them. So you can have three three uh, point polys, four point polys, and bigger than four point polys. And the number of non-planar is three. You shouldn't have to worry about that. And the wick up. Right. So all we need to do now is just save this out. Save object as. And this is called glass. Okay, simple as that. <coughs> so what we're going to do now is you can go to Studio Max and you're going to load this up. No, don't change any location. Just leave it exactly where it is. And then when this model, when it comes in, as it gets assembled with multiple imports, it just come back together and you have all separate models for separate surfaces. And uh, there's probably an L script to do this, but um, I don't know where it is. So you're going to do it by hand. Um, there you go. That's it. So that concludes today's little video. Hope you find that useful. And uh, ta-ta on all that. See you later. Bye.